Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be showing you guys this newish type of palette that just came out, I believe, last month in September. And it's the 35C palette from Morphe. And let me tell you guys, look how beautiful this looks. Shout out to Vanessa because she actually bought this for me and I haven't been excited for a palette in a while and this, like, it's just, I don't even know how to explain it. It's so beautiful. Like, we were talking about it and we said that it looks like springish going into fall, like summer, spring leading into fall. And honestly, I completely see that because you do have a lot of cute um, fall shades. Also, like a plum, like, right there. And then these cute little, like, pink purpley looks looks eyeshadows but yeah also my hair isn't done um i'm about to be late for work but yeah this is the final look this is my second time doing this because the first time i didn't like how the look came out but that's another story but yeah this is the look that i came up with and hopefully you guys enjoy it because honestly i really like it the shade i'm gonna go ahead and give like a little mini review before i go ahead and start doing my eyeshadow so they do have a little bit of fallout the shimmer shade wasn't too bad i didn't need to use um a setting spray or any type of spray really um but yeah the colors in here are beautiful and when i say beautiful it's because look at them they're beautiful and i'm all here for it i honestly I'm not mad. The shadows blended in beautifully, so I don't have an issue with that. Alright, so let's go ahead and get into it. This is probably going to be a quick little video and I'm going to be talking throughout it. Um, but yeah, so the first shade that I'm going to be taking is this shade right here. And that's going to be my transition shade. Um, also, guys, I don't... It comes with a little paper, like a little plastic cover, and it has the names on it, but I honestly don't keep those at all. I just don't. So I recorded this video once already with a different um, colors or whatever. Yeah, like a different eyeshadow look, but I just really wasn't feeling it. You know, it was one of those days that you just feel like your makeup looks like crap so i just i don't know if i'm gonna be uploading it if i don't and you guys are seeing it you know the video and the eyeshadow look really came like crap also know that i've been missing for two weeks so what happened was that i got hold on before i tell you now i'm gonna go in with with this deep brown shade So I had ordered my, and I'm just going to be applying this to the crease, like kind of making a line. So I had ordered my stuff, my um, clothes from Shein, um, so I can do that full haul um, clothes that I got, full haul, whatever. Um, and yeah, so... It originally said that I was supposed to get here October 12th and it said that it was going to be here the Friday of next week. Like eventually said, oh, it's going to get there Friday, blah, blah, blah. So I was super excited. I was like, okay, I already missed one week of filming. Almost going to miss two and um, I can go ahead and get it up as soon as I get it. But no, um, I'm a little slow and my package actually got delivered to my old address and then I went to go see at my old address like oh hey maybe my package is still there maybe you know people are at work this time maybe it's still on the front porch and I can get my package and go call it a day <sighs> so my package wasn't there no one was home and I left a note and I was like oh, what if no one calls me what if they kept it to themselves? What if, you know, a lot of what ifs. 
So eventually the lady that lives there called me back thankfully and she had told me she sent it back to the post office. So I'm getting back that um, transition shade. So I can go ahead and start blending the brown, the dark brown and the transition shade together. So she eventually told me, she was like, hey, so I returned it back. I'm so sorry. And she was like, I sent it to the post office. And I can't even be mad at her. Like, honestly, I can't. The fact that she actually called and she's like, yeah, I returned it. Like, that just says a lot. <laughs> so she was like, maybe you can go back to the post office and see if it's still there. And I was like, okay, yeah, you're right. So I took my little ass and dipped real quick to the post office. And then I got there and they're like, we sent it back. I was like, well, great. So now here I am patiently waiting for my package to get here to my new house and i'm not even gonna have the video up like this is supposed to be here october 12th so let's just see how that goes also my birthday is coming up and i feel like it's been years honestly before i like made a big deal of my birthday i don't know i'm just like okay whatever it's just another day it feels like another day i don't really know what i'm gonna do um but yeah next i'm gonna be grabbing this like forest and green army green whatever you want to call it color and guys it's so beautiful last time i had a shade like this um was in the soul tree I, no not soul tree what is it called? The Subculture Palette. And it's this kind of green. But this green looks a little bit better. And honestly, it perform performs a lot better also. Because let me tell you, I had problems with that um, eyeshadow. Just that palette in general. So I am going to be applying that shade on the outer part and the inner part of my eye. And you're going to see here in a few minutes how I do it. I'm really trying so hard to hurry up. I have to go to work. So I feel like I haven't been as excited for a palette in a while. But this one, girl. This one here. It's so pretty, like there's fall colors there's cute little pink colors that i like there's like a maroon plum purplish shade i don't even know what to call it and it's just i don't know it's just really pretty and they have like this black shade on the bottom with like blue um little flecks of um like glitter and it's so pretty i'm kind of scared to use black though i'm not gonna lie because i feel like if, once you mess up with it it's just like your whole look is messed up. Okay, so now this is the part where I kind of go back and forth between each shade. Um, just with leftover product or if I need more product, I'll definitely go into the palette and get more. But this is the part where I kind of just start blending everything out together and then I'll be adding the middle shade um but i just want to get everything blended out first before i do anything else and then mess it up even more with glitter or shimmer everywhere so next color i'm gonna get is this gold shimmery shade 
So I didn't realize I was already recording, but I go ahead and apply it right here in the middle where I didn't put any eyeshadow. And kind of just take it up a little bit, a little bit to the crease. And yeah, and there you go. And then you can go back in your green um, if you want and just, if you want it a little bit smaller, just kind of start blending it in slowly with the leftover product that you had. And kind of just tap and blend. Okay, I honestly like how it looks already. So I'm gonna go in with my eyelash mascara, my eyelash, my mascara and just apply it. So I felt like I gave the telescopic um, mascara a good chance like i give it a good few months not even months honestly i think a month um of wearing it under my lashes and it just it flakes a lot like it ends up flaking i don't i feel like it doesn't do anything like much it's i just needed something to coat my lashes i do but it just i feel like it just did nothing for me like it just eventually started flaking a lot um, throughout the day and you would see like little um, mascara spots on my face so for this look i am going to be using kind of short like a little bit more short of a lash just because i want my eyeshadow to like stand out a little bit more because i know if i wear like big lashes it just it'll they will cover it all it's gonna cover the whole thing and I feel like it's not gonna look as good. But I am using some that are like shorter from the front, getting longer as it goes out. I'm honestly liking this look a lot better than what I had done before. I wish I could have opened this with you guys, but it just didn't work out. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and let that dry. And as that dries, guys, I will be right back. I'm gonna go ahead and do my face, highlighter, bronzer, whatever off the camera and then we can go ahead and finish this look with the lower lash line so i'll be right back okay so i did go ahead and finish everything else um so now what i'm gonna go ahead and do is oh, i am gonna be taking the like greenish shade and i'm just gonna be applying it to the outer part as well as the inner part Basically everything that I did on the top, I'm going to do the same to the bottom. And then I'm going to be grabbing that gold shade one more time and start blending it into the green. Honestly, this look might not be everyone's cup of tea, but I honestly like it a lot better than when I came out with the first time. I feel like next video, I definitely want to do something with like little diamond type stuff. Um, I don't know, just something different. And then I'm going to go ahead and coat my lower lashes. Once that is done, I'm going to get the gold shade one more time and apply that to my inner tear duct just because I still want a little bit more shimmer everywhere else like it just made it pop like 10 times more make sure to blend it in if you are doing this um, that way it doesn't like just look like one type of thing you know all right and the lip gloss that i am using today is from morphe um the madison beer Kern collection in the shade um mars but yeah this is the final look i hope you guys enjoyed it go ahead like subscribe let me know what else you guys want to see down in the comments below i'll have everything that i use today down below also my face but really this is mostly about the 35c palette from Morphe, and that's it 
um kind of just like a little review type of look with it also but yeah i'll see you guys on the next one